What if Aang was a Pokemon trainer? In this video, I have 15 minutes to catch Pokemon that Aang would catch if he were a trainer. My friend Adam is doing the same thing, but as Zuko. Let's see what kind of team we can build as Aang. Aang, I know we're friends in the show, but today we're enemies. I'm gonna kill you. You're gonna kill me, bro? Whoa, whoa! Oh, wait, no, I mean, I'm gonna defeat you in battle. Yeah. And I'm gonna restore balance to the world. Oh, wait, that's you. Oh, crap, I'm Zuko. What is, what are you saying? All right, 20 minutes on the clock. Three, two, one, go! Go! All right, boys, we are Aang, which means that we can pretty much only catch Pokemon that would make sense for Aang to also catch. And given that Aang is indeed an airbender, it would make sense to, for the most part, catch flying type Pokemon. Right off the bat, Pokemon that I was thinking that would be perfect for Zuko's team. Charizard, obviously, that's a fire-type Pokemon. We have Blaziken, which um is pretty much like that dude that does fire kicks, which Zuko does in the flipping show. So, I mean, he has to be on the team. So, if you guys were Aang, which Pokemon in particular do you think that you'd be able to catch? Oh, and check this out, Notaria. This is a dragon and flying-type Pokemon, but it literally has clouds on it. The clouds work as wings for Altaria. I think that is a perfect fit for Aang because it's literally in the clouds, which which is where Ang pretty much lives. Then for legendaries, there's a dragon fire type legendary called Reshiram that we flip and need. Like that, if I can find him, that would be perfect for Zuko's team. Okay, right now we have absolutely no one. We only have 20 minutes, so I kind of I kind of got to move. Comment down below who you guys would add to Zuko's team. I am a little bit worried though because Adam knows a ton about Avatar the show, and him being Zuko means he's probably going to be catching a lot of fire and dragon type Pokemon, which means that he'll get some really strong ones. Oh, here we go. Uh, is this a fire type? Wait, 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 wait. This kind of looks like, dude, okay. I know that th this might not be a fire type, but look at the hair. It looks exactly like the Fire Nation's emblem. Okay, all right, all right. Let's grab this thing. Hey, and look at this. We're already flying less than a minute into this challenge. Unfortunately, we don't have our glider. Oh! A Charizard! So I don't have a list of Pokemon that I'm allowed to catch, not allowed to catch, but kind of just like as I go, I'm gonna have to make up whether or not it sort of makes sense. And I think Charizard does make a lot of sense, actually. I know that he's a dragon, so that might not make a lot of sense, but he's flying and fire type. And as the avatar, Aang not only has the ability to airbend, but he can also firebend, waterbend, and earthbend. And since Charizard is flying and fire, it sort of makes sense because Aang can use both of those bending techniques. But this isn't any Charizard. This is actually a Halloween form Charizard, so he actually looks insanely cool. Oh, crap, dude. When the pre I'm telling you, this, this looks easy, but when time comes, we only have 20 minute timer. The pressure on. Like, I need to find Pokemon quickly. I haven't found anyone yet. Or another flying type fire Pokemon quick so that I can start flying around. Then I can easily spot Pokemon and capture them. We will defeat Aang. Oh, and here we have a Porygon, but it's a boss, so we can't even catch it. I do think Porygon would be a Pokemon that we could use on our team, though, because it does get the move Tri-Attack, which I believe is like a bunch of different types of moves all sort of combined into one, which is also kind of Aang's signature since he used the Avatar. Where are the Pokemon? Pokemon. Dude, where are my fire type when I need them? Who is this? Yamper? You would, you're not, you're not on Zuko's team. You're not, no. No, oh my gosh, dude. You know, this would actually be pretty good for Tov's team, I think, or like Uncle Iroh's, but not Zuko. I'm powerful, I'm strong, I love dragons, and I love fire-type Pokemon. Oh, that gave me a great idea. Guys, there's one Pokemon in particular that can pretty much be any type in the game. I don't know if you can guess who I'm thinking of, but there's one really strong Pokemon in particular. Oh, and check this out, it's a Halucha. That is a flying and fighting-type Pokemon, but it kind of looks like its wings are like a glider. And so for that reason, I feel like it makes sense that Aang would be able to use him on his team because Aang always uses a glider to fly around. So let's go ahead and catch the Halucha. Level 36, definitely not too bad. Another one that I could get is probably like Rayquaza. It looks exactly like Zuko's dragon in Legend of Korra. Like literally to the T. Oh, wait, wait. Is this a fire type? Is Entei a fire type? No, he's not. Dude, oh my gosh, he would look perfect on our team, but he, he wouldn't fit. Gosh darn it, dude. Oh, and there's another Pokemon, a Gliscor, that also sort of looks like it uses a glider. That one probably is more glider-esque than how Lucha's. But let's go ahead and catch this Gliscor as well. Dude, I, I, don't, I don't think I'm gonna have enough time to build a flipping team. Oh, I spoke to flipping soon. Let's go. 
Yes! Okay, we got our first real Pokemon on Zuko's team. It's a flipping Charizard. Let's go! I don't know if there's a better Pokemon that would fit on Zuko's team. I know Charizard isn't technically a dragon type, but I mean, this would be perfect in Avatar. Oh, there's an Infernape. I definitely feel like that's a Pokemon that would suit Zuko pretty well. I also feel like... I kind of maybe am able to catch him as the avatar because I can fire Ben technically. So does that mean I should be able to catch it? I don't really know, but we're definitely going to anyway. I actually feel like it probably make a lot of sense for us to have one flying, one ground, one fire, and one water type Pokemon on our team. That makes a lot of sense. All right, now we can fly around and actually go for people. Oh, is that a Moltres? Dude, that would be good on Zuko's team. I'm getting it. I'm getting it. That's a Firebird. Come on. Oh my gosh, I'm not even close. Come on. Okay, I gotta plop down. I'm going down. I'm going down. Dude, if I can get that Moltres, my team is gonna be flipping sick. Come on. This is literally a Firebird. This would go perfect on Zuko's team. It's going through him. Give me Moltres, dude. Come on. I'm spamming this thing. This game doesn't make any sense. This game... Oh, yes. Yes, it makes total sense. We got him. We flipping got Moltres. Let's go. Ooh, here's a Rhyhorn. That is a ground-type Pokemon. So let's go ahead and catch him. But oh, my. Yeah. It's an Eternamon. Max, bro, what the heck? That definitely does not suit Aang at all, and neither does a Zygarde. Ooh, wait, what is that? What is that? What is that? What is that? It's a Buffalant. Okay, listen, hear me out. I'm gonna capture this thing, but not for me. This is so Alec can't get this guy because Alec could technically fit him on Aang's team because he's a Bison. That would be the perfect fit for him, so I'm gonna steal it. Okay, so we do have our Flying type Pokemon, a Fire type Pokemon, a Ground type Pokemon, but we do still need a Water type Pokemon. And speaking of the gosh dang devil, we got maybe one of the best Water type Pokemon in the entire game. That is the Generation 2 legendary Pokemon, Suicune. Let's go. So I'm not sure Infernape really does fit. I feel like of all these Pokemon, Halucha probably fits the least as an Ang Pokemon. So for now, this is our team, but there's definitely still other really good Pokemon that I could catch that would make a lot of sense for Ang to use. Imagine how much easier it would be if Zuko had a flipping Charizard instead of the, the little boat he had in season one. Oh my gosh, he would have captured Ang in two seconds. Just like I'm about to do. Wait, why am I going after Aang? I have to build Zuko a team. Oh, and there's one right there, a Boofalan. Now, a lot of you guys might be like, how on earth does that fit Aang's team? Well, if you guys remember from the series, you really can't forget his signature pet, Appa, is literally a giant flying bison. Now, I don't know if Boofalan is exactly a bison, but it certainly reminds me of one. The only way this would be more of a perfect fit would be if Boofalan could fly, but unfortunately, um, this is how I'm he can jump. So Boofalant is definitely going to be staying on the team. I'm actually going to nickname him right now, and we're going to call him Appa. Okay, guys, comment down below what other Pokemon you think would be on Zuko's team. Right now, we have Cementseer, Charizard, Moltres, and Bluffalant, but we're not going to use Bluffalant because I just stole that from Aang. I'm really looking for, like, a Blaziken or mm, definitely a Reshiram. I want a Typhlosion and a Drudagon. I feel like that would be the perfect team. Oh my gosh, wait, there's a second Charizard. Can I, can I have two Charizards on one team? I'm going for it. Ah! Come here, Charizard! Get in my ball! I think that worked. Oh, and here's another Pokemon that fits Aang extraordinarily well. I don't know if you guys are thinking what I'm thinking, but this Emolga reminds me so much of Momo. Momo is another one of Aang's pets. I don't know exactly what it would be. It's kind of like a flying squirrel. And literally, Emolga is just that. Emolga is a flying and electric type Pokemon, so it's actually gonna fit the team really well. Oh, wait, we have another Pokemon over here. This looks like he has potential to be a fire type or something. Wait, who's this guy? Oh, he, dude, he would definitely be on Zuko's team. This kind of looks like Uncle Iroh if he was like a fire Pokemon. <laughs> I definitely need an Uncle Iroh on my team. Guys, our team is looking amazing, but we still have seven minutes left to catch Pokemon. I feel like there's so many great Pokemon out here that represent Aang, but I don't want to replace any of our current Pokemon because they all fit so well. Our team's coming together pretty nicely, if I do say so myself. We just got an Embor, which I don't know exactly what he does, but he looks exactly like Uncle Iroh with like extra fire bending effects. He's definitely a great addition to the team. Ooh, Dodrio. This is another Pokemon that I believe gets the move Try Attack. I don't know if I'm going to use it, but, but that move just fits so well with the Avatar that I, that I feel like we have to catch it. Ooh, and there's an Arcanine. That is definitely a Pokemon that Zuko would use on his team. So hopefully Adam does not stumble across that guy. Okay, how the flip do I fly, guys? Oh my God, please. Please comment down below. How do I fly in Pixelmon? This is kind of ridiculous. I'm just sinking. Zuko would be disappointed in me, man. Oh my gosh, dude. These Pokemon would be perfect. They have like the 
same exact structure and style and color as Zuko, but like it's a flipping centipede looking thing. Like he, he would not fit on the team. He looks like that spirit guy from one of the episodes when Aang goes into the spirit world. And he, and he, he I think he's called the face stealer. That's what that dude looks like. Oh, <laughs> let's go. We found an Arceus, guys. Oh, I was getting so worried. There's only five minutes left on the clock. I was honestly getting worried that we were not going to find one of these. And this was the Pokemon that I was referencing earlier on in the video. This is the Pokemon that can change to any type in the entire game. It's pink right now, so I guess it's probably a fairy type Arceus. But guys, that is so epic. He is pretty much the epitome of what an avatar would be. He is the master of all different typings. Obviously, we have to use him, but I just have no idea who to replace. Oh, wait, dude, this guy looks cool. And he's got like the little fire spikes. Okay, he's not confirmed on my team, but I'm gonna pick him up. This could be a potential add to the Zuko team. I'm hype. I'm flipping hype. Oh, yes, yes. He's a fire type. He's definitely making Zuko's team. Dude, he's got an ember taunt, flare, and a superpower. This is like literally perfect. This is Zuko. If Zuko was a Pokemon, he would be a Darmanitan. I know that seems like a weird decision, but I just feel like Altaria represents the sky and airbending better than Charizard does. And of course, Arceus is going to be the avatar himself. Suicune will represent our waterbedding technique, and Gliscor represents Aang's glider itself. And then we have Emolga and Boofalant, who represent Momo and Appa. Honestly, guys, I can't think of a better team of six that represent Aang better than these guys. But we do still have two minutes on the clock to see if we can find any more Pokemon that work. All right, Charizard, let's keep on moving. Oh, is that Arceus? Yo! Ah! No! No, I had Arceus right there. I don't even know if I could have added him. Oh, God. No, 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 no. Man, there's so many amazing Pokemon that I'm finding, but I just can't seem to find any that make more sense than any of the Pokemon on my current team. Come on. I need someone quick. I need someone. Oh, is that who I think it is? Yo, it's a Blaziken. Let's go. Thank you, Poke Gods. Holy crap, dude. I've been looking for this dude all day. Get in my Pokeball. Yes. Wait, we actually kind of have a fire team right now. Oh, wait, what the heck? It's a Typhlosion. Oh, wait, no, it's a Quilava. It's the it's the evolution, but okay, we'll take him anyways. He's perfect. Is this a Siren? Dude, this is a Siren? Like, what, what is this Pokemon? What the heck is this? I've never seen this before in my life. All right, I'm just gonna collect that thing. That's kind of a joke. That's kind of funny. And just like that, guys, that is the timer. Time is up, Mr. Zuko. You know what? I'm actually happy with my team, Sire. Or Aang. <laughs> Aang? I'm, I'm pretty happy with my team, too, actually. You ready to get burned, Aang? Uh, I think so. Ooh, Quilava. That is a cool Pokemon. Little firecracker. This is when Zuko gets angry. I'm gonna hit you with some ember. How are those flames, Siren? Didn't really do much. I'm gonna hit you with the smoke screen. That was good. That was a good... Yeah, your defense seems... Oh, God. Oh, God, dude. Oh, God. That was a good smoke screen. Very useful out of Zuko. Dude, what the heck? This is unfair. What the... My moves aren't doing any damage. I feel like fire against air is kind of uneven. I'm gonna have to pull out a dragon move. There we go, baby! Big hits! Oh, yeah, that actually did do a lot. We're gonna wipe you out, baby! Come on! Ooh! Let's go, Charizard! But that's okay. Look, I have my water guys. A water Pokemon for Aang? Because I'm the avatar. I get all the different bending techniques. Dude, I didn't think you'd cheat like that. Um, You're technically right, but that's ridiculous. That's right. Ridiculous. I was stuck to Zuko. You get fire Pokemon, dragon Pokemon. If you get water Pokemon, it's uneven. I'm going to lose. That's the avatar difference, bro. Like, that's why the avatar is so strong. I should win this battle. You know what? The only thing that can beat Siren is Siren. Siren Ace. That's funny. Oh, my. Dude, you just killed yourself. Yeah, sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do to win the game. Oh, it's Appa! We got Appa in the house! Wait, that's kind of cool. Oh, wow, that just hurt a lot. Yeah! Let's go, baby! Yeah! Get him, Appa! Appa with the big charge. Wow, you just destroyed Appa. Okay, okay. What about Momo? Oh, pull out Momo. I'll, I will delete Momo with a fire blast. Oh, my God! That just destroyed me! No! But he comes back and hits hard. Okay, this is my last guy. It's pretty much like Uncle Iroh. Oh, my God! That is Uncle Iro, yeah. Okay, I'm switching into the last Pokemon that you have not seen. The Avatar himself. Oh my god, you're pretty much God. Yeah! This is ridiculous. He can turn into any type. He literally is the Avatar of Pokemon. Let's go! GG, Zuko! If I had any fire abilities, I'd blast you right now.